Keeping up with today's fast-paced world can be difficult. Accelerate your life with iFiber Communications high-speed internet. Surf, stream, and game like never before. Give us a call at 509-754-2600 and find out more at iFiber.tv. Washington legislators want the state's liquor control agency out of the business of ensuring safety for cannabis crops produced here. The House voted last month, and the Senate followed up this week to approve a bill removing the Liquor and Cannabis Board's authority to certify cannabis testing labs. Those are the private commercial labs that determine whether Washington-grown marijuana crops meet standards for safety and potency. Under law, labs must test for contaminants, pesticides, and dangerous bacteria before cannabis can be sold. In 2016, auditors found some of those labs were using flawed methods, conspiring with growers, and faking test results. Among other steps, House Bill 2052 would transfer testing authority to the Department of Ecology starting in the next two to four years. Although the bill has passed both chambers by huge margins, its differing versions have to be reconciled and pass again before it can be signed into law. The state legislative session is scheduled to end April 28th. Jefferson Robbins, iFiber One News.